That's the third time this week. I want it outside from now on. You know we can't go outside. Do you remember last time? I'm getting sick and tired of cleaning up after it. If you won't do it, it goes. I can just potty train him. <laughs> Good luck with that. Uncle, I'm getting really sick and tired of your negative attitude. Get off the table! I'll clean this up. Hey, Mom. No, I, I've been great, thank you. Yeah, I just finished packing. What? No, 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 I understand. Yeah, I love you too. Bye. Connor, I'm sorry. I'm all right, it's just... I'm fine. Uh, with the extra towel, I'll, I'll take slime out. Hey, Connor. Do you wanna go for dinner tonight? I mean, you've been pestering me about it, so... Um, I would like that. Thanks, Uncle. I'll talk to you later, then. Alright, I'll do that. Hello? Excuse me, are you Ian? Connor, you know who I am. Take off the mask. Excuse you, sir. I'm Xavier Officeman from the office. I'm here to investigate why you failed to turn in our missing assignments. I am terribly sorry. I haven't slept much these past few days. Please come in. This is terribly disgusting for a man of standing in our company. I've been meaning to hire a maid. Hmm. So what's the reason? Well, you see, um, well, my printer isn't working. May I examine this printer? Yes, of course, right this way. It's downstairs. It's quite dark down here. Can I turn on the light? Um, I'd love to, but the lights haven't worked in months. Not a problem. I come prepared for such circumstances. Ah, uh, just as I thought, the printer wasn't turned on. Oh, <laughs> well, yeah, that would explain it. I sure hope you have another reason to explain why we aren't getting your reports. Um, well, I've been having computer problems as well, and this, of course, preventing me from working on it. And what you're saying is that our company computers weren't adequate enough? Unfortunately, all my work was saved on the laptop. Oh! This is quite disgusting, and I will be filing a report on this. If you don't turn on those reports tonight, you'll be losing your job. I'll have to ask you to leave now. Excuse me? So that I can finish my work. Good riddance. Slime. Same to you, buddy. Uncle? Uncle? Oh! What happened? What do you think happened? Why did you let it back in? We had company. I'm sorry, I didn't know. I wouldn't have let him in if had we, and I was talking to a I friend see. and... Should I get ready for dinner? No, I have work to do now. Alright. Slime, I hope you know this is your fault. Go back upstairs. I'm not that old.
straight like so bright. Good one, Sly. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> You ready? This is for gold. Connor? Yeah? Can I talk to you for a moment? Yeah, sure. Let me just slide. Good boy. So, I, um, I called your mother last night. I know. Um, thank you. It means a lot to me. So you still have for that dinner? Of course. Slime! I just understand why mothers wouldn't be around me and now slime. Don't worry about it. I mean, look at slime. It's just an animal. And animals do some pretty dumb stuff. And time can separate people for a while. But in time, people will always meet again. So just know that your mother loves you very much. Thanks, Uncle. I could tell you're reading off your hand. Well, we aren't all perfect. You ready to go? Obviously, I haven't eaten all day. Oh yeah, Slime, I got you now. Wow, oh, good God, job, God. Slime. Hi, Slime. Slime, Slime. Oh, what What's a going cheater. On here? Slime beat me again. How did you lose to something with no eyes? <laughs>